of conscious rest, the power of undoing the tensions that we hold in our body and in our mind, and how powerful that really is. With Yoga Nidra, which is Sanskrit for yoga sleep, I'll guide you in a much longer, 25 to 30 minute guided relaxation where we'll go slowly, but quite consciously, quite lucidly through the body and relax and to feel ourselves relax bit by bit over this long extended time. You may think you'll fall asleep, but you'll be so engaged in the process that rather than falling asleep, I hope you find yourself wide awake. Enjoy. Begin Yoga Nidra as you would Shavasana, but giving yourself extra support in anticipation of the lengthy and delicious practice to come. I suggest lying on a blanket with another folded blanket under your head and shoulders. A bolster or rolled blanket under your thighs. covering yourself with a blanket and resting an eye bag or folded washcloth over your eyes. You lie on your back with your feet wide and your arms a generous distance away from your sides with your palms up. Take a moment to make yourself comfortable and feel free as we continue to adjust whenever you feel like it. As you relax, your body will tell you what it wants. It will settle into its most relaxed self. With your eyes closed, take a moment to become aware of your breath. Yoga Nidra or yoga sleep is an ancient practice of deep relaxation, guided imagery and meditation that calms emotions, relieves stress, promotes sound sleep, rejuvenation, and mental clarity. It's similar to Shavasana, the deep relaxation pose, in that is a practice that invites the body and the mind to relax and wake up. The difference lies in the time you're choosing to spend dropping into the conscious art of rest and coming out the other side rejuvenated and at peace. Yoga Nidra practiced in the evening can quiet the mind and lead to a more sound sleep. though you should try to avoid falling asleep while in Yoga Nidra. It's a very lucid pose. If you practice Yoga Nidra during the daytime, you may enjoy following Yoga Nidra with a gentle asana practice, such as the one included here. The clarity and calm of your deep rest will permeate and inform your practice in a profound way. Above all, I discourage you from jumping up from Yoga Nidra and dashing off to a busy day. Re-enter your daily life gradually. And you may find Yoga Nidra inspires you to slow down. As you relax, the rhythm of the breath will naturally slow down and become increasingly soothing. Notice how the body and the mind begin already to unwind.
Take a moment to consider what you hope to achieve with this extended, conscious time of rest. Perhaps you desire relief from stress. Perhaps you have a yearning for rejuvenation or better sleep of being more comfortable with yourself or simply finding a sanctuary from the busy world in which we live. Your motivation can be anything. Take a moment to consider what is drawing you to this practice and hold that intention as you begin now to meet your body and ask it to let go of the tension that you've been holding every day. Let's do a conscious scan of the body, asking each part to wake up and then let go of any holding. Begin with the right side of the body, starting at your feet. Inhale, be aware of your feet. And as you exhale, relax the big toe. the second toe, the third, the fourth, and the little toe. Let go of the sole of your foot, the top of your foot, Relax your ankle. Moving up the leg, exhale and release the lower leg. The shin. The calf. Move to the knee. Let the knee melt. And feel your thigh rest against the bolster. Relax the back of your leg. And the front thigh, near the hip, a commonly tight spot. Relax the right buttock. Now move your attention to the belly. Linger here, allowing each out breath to further soften the belly. Rest your lower ribs, an area of common congestion and emotional holding. Each exhalation helps you relax your upper abdomen. Feel it become heavy and let it grow light. Move your awareness to the chest and shoulder. Let the shoulder melt into the blanket that supports it. It feels good to let go.
soften into the right neck and ear. And let the release flow down the arm to the elbow. Adjust the arm if it asks you to. Feel the weight of your wrist and hand. And one by one, relax thumb, index finger, your middle finger, your ring finger, and your pinky. Relax the palm of the hand. Feel your heavy, relaxed hand. Be aware of what it feels like to rest. Feel the ease. Take your attention to the left side of the body, beginning at the feet. Breathe in, be aware of your feet, and exhaling, relax the big toe, the second toe, the third, the fourth, and the little toe. Let go of the sole of the foot. The top of the foot. Relax your ankle. Moving your attention up the leg, exhale and release the lower leg. The shin and the calf. Let go of all holding. Relax your knee. And feel your thigh resting on your bolster. Relax the back of your leg. And the front thigh near the hip. Relax your left buttock. Lingering here you feel resistance to letting go. Trust you can completely relax. Bring your attention to your belly, letting each exhalation further soften the belly, letting it become deep and calm. Relax your lower ribs, an area of excitement and doubt. The exhalation helps you let it go. And lighten your load.
move your awareness to the left chest and shoulder, allowing the shoulder to melt into the blanket that supports it. It feels good to let go. Soften the left neck and ear. And let the release flow down your arm to the elbow. Feel the weight of your wrist and hand. And one by one, relax. The thumb. The index finger. Middle finger. Ring finger. And your little finger. Relax the palm of the hand. And feel your hand heavy and relaxed on the floor. Now relax your face. Let your eyes grow deep and calm. Relax your jaw. In the root of the tongue. Soften your throat. And your upper chest. Feeling the breath quietly in and out. It soothes. It calms you. Bring your attention to your heart, feeling space. Feel expansive. Relax your upper belly. Just let it go. Emotions and memories can arise and you meet them with compassion. This is all part of you and your history. Be patient. Be kind. Be forgiving. Be resilient. And rest. Dive into your low belly, your source of true knowing, letting it melt to greater depth and calm. The belly is the heart of knowing your true self. Of knowing you are just fine. As the release flows out through your legs, welcome memories. See them and understand that they are part of you. They will always be part of you. Your history. 
feel the relief of that knowing and accept the grief or sadness of experience. Accept being human. Feel the joy that you're human, that you're resilient, that you're reconnecting to the deepest sense of who you are and find contentment in the way you are now. And that your history is your own story and that you are at your center, awake and aware. This is a time of wisdom and you radiate with the light of being aware and alive. Your whole. Accept that at times you will feel weak and at other times strong, knowing that this is what it means to be a human being. And know that by spending time with your truest self, you inform your decisions and your actions. Feel that you are alive. And you can contribute with friendliness, compassion, joy for others, and have equanimity. Now revisit the intention you set as you begin this yoga nidra, yoga sleep. And look at that intention from this place of deep awareness. Slowly turn to one side and rest your head on your arm. With your eyes still closed, Become aware of the room. Become aware of the outside. And taking your time, slowly come to sit. Bring your palms together at your chest and gently bowing your head. Follow Yoga Nidra with sleep, a gentle yoga practice, or relaxed few hours of leisure. <laughs> 